How to decide a name of a company or LLP? The name of a company or the LLP is critical for a startup and at times it is a difficult task to select an available name for company registration. In India, we have a well-defined law to deal with the name of a company also known as naming guidelines. Generally, every kind of business should consider these rules which prescribe a business to name itself with the legal and non-resembling name. Before the founders or co-founders starts deliberating the proposed name, we suggest you consider the following three essential elements. Number 1. The name should be unique and must contain business activities. Number 2. The business activity should not be the first word. Number 3. You should not violate someone else's trademark. Avail the name facility. Log into our website www.setindiabiz.com Number 4. The name meets the requirements of the company's act. 2013 Business Activities in Name A company or LLP is always registered for a lawful purpose. And now the question is, can I incorporate a company with more than one category of activities? Or is it necessary for the name of the company to carry the activities? The answer is that the name of the company should reflect the proposed business activities of the company. And only one category of business activity is allowed to be pursued in a new company. When the application for the company name is filed, you have to select the main division of industrial activity of the company from a list which gets populated. You have no choice but to select only one category. Consider trademark, a word, business name, logo, device, etc. which can identify the origin of goods or services is known as a trademark. Under the trademark law, there is a specific provision protecting the lawful owner of the brand against any potential infringement and the courts of India award hefty compensation for a breach of the trademark by any unauthorized use. Hence, before considering any name, please check if it violates someone else's brand. Section 4 of the Companies Act 2013 gives broader guidelines for keeping the name of a company in India. These guidelines intend to prevent the adoption of a name that already exists or which gives an impression to the general public about any government patronage. Another objective is to uphold the provisions of the Emblems and Names Act 1950, whereas Rule 8 provides for the detail and illustration of what is the undesirable name. The sum up, the name of a startup is essential and it must kept after considering the legal provisions in mind. The Google searches and availability of a domain name may be a good and substantive reason. However, this is not a conclusive way to determine whether a particular name is available or not. You may submit your proposed name to Team Set in Tabiz and we shall conduct a feasibility report without any charges. Request for a report from us on the name availability of your company. Just visit our website www.setindiabiz.com Subscribe and click on the bell icon to get corporate updates from Set India Biz. Set India Biz. Business begins here.